Welcome to CryptoCoin.news, you're watching Crypto This Week. Streaming Bitcoin blockchain from space. More Bitcoin predictions. Direct crypto conversions on Coinbase. Ajox, IDUs and Kibis all coming up. Good news for Coinbase users as the company announced new crypto to crypto trading on the Coinbase exchange. Initially, customers will be able to convert between Bitcoin and some of the most popular coins like Ethereum, Ethereum Classic, Litecoin and Bitcoin Cash instantly and also at a very low cost. The exchange will gradually roll out the ability to convert cryptocurrencies to customers in all 34 countries in which Coinbase offers native payment access. The team also plans to gather customer feedback along the way in order to continue to iterate on the feature over time. And also the Coinbase team continues to think of new ways to democratize the best of cryptocurrency and the ability to easily convert from one asset to another seems an important step on this path. Next, as the values of cryptos continue to see a steady decline throughout the year, um, crypto investors and enthusiasts are looking to get comfort in these troubling times. During a recent interview, Jeremy Ale, CEO of Boston-based fintech startup Circle, did not fail to address the current state of market affairs. Ale started out by claiming that from a fundamental perspective, Bitcoin and Ethereum are both largely oversold. The Circle chief claimed that the amount of usage on the two networks justify higher short-term valuations for their respective assets. When asked about his personal thoughts on the futures of cryptos, Jeremy noted that he isn't too keen on significant price predictions. But however, he believes that it is certainly going to be worth more than it is today in three years' time. He also stated that he is long on the Bitcoin price because of the uniqueness of its security and scale, calling Bitcoin attractive all around the world. And now there is a next level for the blockchain industry as a blockchain development team, Blockstream has expanded its satellite service and is now broadcasting the Bitcoin blockchain to all of the world's major land masses. Um, the addition of the fifth least satellite brings a wider coverage and should bring potential internet-free Bitcoin transactions and information sharing to Bitcoin and crypto users in the Asia-Pacific region. The satellite service, still in its beta version, had already been available across Africa, Europe, South and North America. Blockstream has already reportedly launched a new application programming interface which allows the satellite to be used to exchange encrypted messages and pair for them using micropayments on the Lightning Network. It seems that Blockstream's ultimate aim is to create uncensorable communications, modeling after Bitcoin being uncensorable money. And this week's airdrops, IDUs and Kibis. IDUs Global Defund platform is a decentralized fund market established on the Ethereum network to serve as a professional asset management platform in which global investors and asset management companies are able to use blockchain technologies and smart contracts to safely and transparently create and settle into peer-to-peer -peer fund agreements. IDUS is airdropping 100 AID tokens, the equivalent of $6 to airdrop participants. One AID token equals 0.06 USD and the airdrop is until January 12, 2019. Our next and final airdrop is Kibis, which is an innovative kiosk supplier and operator that plans to become the principal payment provider for millions of people around the world. Using kiosk and offering a wide variety of services, Kibis will become a secure, fast and efficient option for people to easily access financial services whenever and wherever they want. Kibis has airdropped 25 Kibis tokens, the equivalent of $15 to airdrop participants, and one Kibis equals 0.60 USD. And that's all for Crypto This Week. I'm Aidy Tandy. Don't forget to subscribe for more. Until next time.